So today we're gonna to talk about why this harmless low glycemic fructose is so bad for us. I mean, fructose comes from fruit, it's harmless, right? The sugar is low on the glycemic index, it's like a 19, whereas glucose is 100. So why is it that fructose and things like high fructose corn syrup are so bad? So just so you know, high fructose corn syrup is about 42 to 55% fructose, and the rest is glucose. So it's not 100% glucose at all. Now in nature, fruit is seasonal, right? But nowadays, especially in the US, the daily consumption of fructose is roughly between 85 to 100 grams of fructose every single day. That is a tremendous amount of fruit sugar that's going into our bodies. Now there's a huge difference in how fructose is metabolized versus glucose. Now, when you consume glucose, all of your cells can metabolize it. Okay, but with fructose, it is only metabolized or broken down by your liver. So if we're taking like 100 grams of glucose in a given day, and we're force feeding it to the liver, that is a huge stress for your liver. So even though it's low on the glycemic index, well, what happens, it creates a significant amount of triglycerides. In other words, the fructose can be converted into fat. This is called de novo lipogenesis the formation of lipids from carbohydrate. This is what leads to metabolic syndrome, which is also called diabetes. Now, metabolic syndrome is like high blood pressure, high glucose, belly fat, high triglycerides. It's a very, very dangerous condition. And right now, 50% of the population has metabolic syndrome. Also, when you consume fructose, you're actually also generating glucose as well from fructose. And you're also creating insulin resistance. And the more insulin resistance you have, the more this process occurs where fructose is converted into triglycerides. So even though fructose seems to be very harmless, it's very, very hard in the liver simply because the liver is forced to deal with it. And our bodies were never designed to metabolize that much fructose. And as a side note, the fruit that people are consuming has been manipulated genetically to make the carbohydrates much, much higher. So the more metabolic syndrome we have, the more diabetes we have. From 1935 to 1996, there's been an increase in diabetes type two by 765%. So avoid fructose at all costs. Before you go real quick, I have a course entitled How to Bulletproof Your Immune System. It's a free course. I want you to take it. And here's why. Here's you, here is your environment. Everyone is focused on this over here, avoiding your environment. But what about here? What about strengthening your immune system? That's what's missing. This course will show you how to bulletproof yourself. And so you can tolerate and resist your environment much better by strengthening your own immune system. I put a link down in the description right down below Check it out and get signed up today. Hey, before.